Okay, when was the last time you had your air ducts clean? If the answer is never, don't worry. This is why we have Dan Billingsley, president of Heatwave Healing, Heating, Cooling and Plumbing here with us to talk about some recommendations and even replacement if that's what's needed. Thank you, Dan, for coming to the show. Thanks for having me. And you know, we were talking about this is the holy grail, cleaning the air ducts correctly. When do you recommend that people do this? Um, well, in our market, you really should have your ducts cleaned every two to three years. Um, there is a lot of stuff in the air here that people don't realize. A lot of molds, bacteria, danders, and stuff in the air. And then it depends on your home, too. If you have pets, kids running in and out of the house, age of your home, et cetera. And you know, sometimes we don't even think about what we have up there in the attic. This is where the unit is mostly placed in most homes, right? Is that the standard? Yeah, well, at least a third of it is. Okay. So a third of your air conditioning system is your ductwork. Okay. It's what brings the cold air around to the house from the air conditioner. Um, 90 plus percent of the houses here, the ductwork runs through the attic. And it, the attic's hot all year long. The ductwork basically bakes in the oven all year long. It gets brittle. The material breaks down. Sometimes it causes leaks. That brings in attic air infiltrating the ductwork. Okay. You know, which can bring in that insulation fibers from your attic or even just attic air in general is not healthy to breathe. Right. So then that's distributing that throughout your home on top of everything else that's going on. Now, and I just want to make sure that we have the right information. This is beyond changing the filter, right? Because yeah. we may do that a month on a monthly basis. Right. This is different. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So um, your ductwork, a good duct system shouldn't really get dirty as long as you're cleaning your filter. Again, your air conditioning maintained like you're supposed to. Okay. Um, as long as it doesn't break down, get holes in it, etc. I got it. And I know that people <clears throat> perhaps didn't even think about all these scenarios even before COVID. Now, after the pandemic, we're more cognizant about these viruses and all these bacteria that could yeah. accumulate up there. What's another tip for them? So the, the tip would be to get your air conditioning maintained every six months, just like you're supposed to. And then part of our air conditioning inspection is we also inspect your ductwork. So we're gonna go up in your attic every six months after we're done cleaning your AC unit, we're gonna go through and inspect your ductwork with a fine tooth comb and make sure it's doing exactly what it's supposed to be doing. Perfect, and I know you have a special deal for our Morning Blend viewers specifically that can help them with that process, right? Tell me about that. Yeah, so what we have is our air conditioning tune-up. It's a 58-point inspection. We're gonna clean and inspect your AC system, and part of our AC inspection is we also do a full ductwork inspection. Oh. So we're gonna crawl through the attic, inspect your ductwork, make sure everything is exactly what it's supposed to be. Um, if there's any issues we'll, we'll let you know but you definitely want to know because most people aren't going to go crawl around their attic to find right. out themselves <laughs> and you know we want to keep the healthy environment so that is a must specifically yeah. here in florida when we have these long weeks of just you know hot uh, weather that that ac is cranking there huh every day of course and of course you have more information about this deal for our morning blend viewers you can log on to heatwavehvac.com or the number on your screen thank you dan thanks for having me